This video make a ting, terrible narration, did it affect and I'm not pretty good explaining stuff verbally without any script and due to my mental disability. So you might hear me stutter or lose my train of thoughts and videos like this one in particular. Proceed with an open mind and bear with me on this. And without any further ado, please enjoy. Hi everyone, it's me, Archilita, aka Swanky Vortex 733. For this tutorial of Audacity, I will be showing you on how to do a robot voice effect. For some reason, I noticed that some of my friends have been having it very difficult on how to do a robot voice effect for, for one of the shows. But for this tip, I'm gonna show you. But before I start, um, yeah, if you're gonna need, you're gonna need a microphone to record, and here's the before the effect. This is me with my robot voice. Pretty cool, huh? But yeah, here's how I'm gonna show you how. First of all, you need to select like the track that you just recorded, and then you're gonna go to effect and then hit duplicate. Once you do that, you can also hit it again. You can also use Control D on your keyboard. I'm gonna have to mute that one since I'm gonna use it for the last part. So here's step two. You go to change pitch. So yeah, you you, you gotta have to make a pitch pitch down. I would recommend an bias one point point six three. I note, I want to say this. I'm not pretty good at explaining things to my disability, so please keep this in mind. <laughs> Anywho, once you had a percent change. As to your like, use, and pre preference, you can click OK, and it was sounds like this. This is me with my robot voice. This is what some people would do. It sounds kind of demonic, but I would recommend this for this one. But you can actually pitch it down, but you can't leave it at that when you do robot characters. Next, you could go. You could go to Echo. And for this one, I would recommend, and for delay time, 0 0.006, and the decay factor has to be, um, 0 0.7 in, in this case. Links to the delay time and decay factor will be in the description below this video. So you put that delay time decay factor in, hit OK, and it will sound like this. This is me with my robot voice. For the last part, and so you can go to Echo again. And I would recommend doing it twice, since for mostly reference. Here's how it sounds. This is me with my robot voice. Woo! However, um, the real problem with, with echoing twice is that it can be extremely, extremely loud. So what you do here is that you can go to Amplify. And you have to amplify it down. So yeah, I, I just chose um, minus 3.6. Once you put that, and hit OK. And it would sound like this. This is me with my robot voice. Oh, god damn, that sounds pretty good. Let's hear it again. This is me with my robot voice. And there you have it. This concludes the tutorial for today. I pretty hope this will be helpful for some people who are who are project creators or some people who are doing object shows. Or you know, fun to watch. <laughs> so yeah. Thank thanks so much for watching. And please give this video a like. And if you like any of my content, be sure to subscribe. If you don't if you want to keep up, turn the bell for notifications. And as always, this is Swaggy Vortex 733 signing off. See ya!